Well, time to depart. But I'll definitely be leaving a big piece of me here. And I'm pretty sure that it'll be there waiting for me next time I come. It's really been an education. This wonderful little place is Chester Harbour and uh, on the way to the airport we've decided to make a day of it so we're making a full day of it and I'll get dropped off the airport in time for my flight but I didn't expect a view as beautiful as this <laughs> picturesque little yeah. harbour in it our oh, little wild, wild briars wild really yeah so this is uh, just going round the next headland from there which is where I did the last clip just lovely little anchorages and that gorgeous little island over there with the and that area there, just wonderful place. Look at it, amazing. I saw a shrine back here. Let's see if you can find that. Found this neatly trimmed little garden with a, a globe. Very trim and what caught my eye with these two Norwegian flags? Oh, there we are. It's in English on the other side. So in appreciation for the hospitality shown the Norwegians who were in Chester during the Second World War. Camp Norway Foundation. Well, that's rather interesting. Very interesting. And there's another monument here. Let's see. In memory of local boys who fell. Right next to Chester Yacht Club. <laughs> A really pretty bandstand. Really beautiful. Well, I must say, we're coming on the, a lovely little round trip, taking in some really spectacular places like this you got the lobster there have you you bought your lobster for a walk <coughs> yeah more than likely what's this place called em this is graves island provincial park graves it's island a campground but this is like a day use area it's really stunning this place we'll go and have a look down here what we can see yeah <laughs> Maya, turn around. Show me lobs. Beautiful place. Um, Maya found me a caterpillar. Look, right there. Take the hips of that small pound. Lobster. Yeah, he's having a walk. These people aren't a while. Yeah. Good little ones. A, a, a corner and saw a duck or something. Yeah, it's a duck of some sort. Aspen's found the the duck.
Take care on those rocks. <laughs> uh, two ducks. Another pair there. I think they're all coming in to say hello. They're very friendly ducks around here. They must be used to getting fed. Loads of perfectly right, low hanging apples. These are for the these are for the deer, yeah, to attract the deer. Excellent. Yeah, well, that's what you should be doing, isn't it? Foraging. It's like finding a new store, isn't it? Yes, they can pop them in at once and chomp on them. Graves Island Provincial Park. Wonderful. Lovely place. I love that lichen that grows on the tree. Look at that. Like a bearded lichen. Yeah. Incredible. Oh, there's a wasp or nest on that tree down there. <laughs> Charcoal pit full of rubbish. What is this place called? Do you know? This is East River. East River. Salt water in this, isn't it? Yeah. What so? Seaweed was a bit of a giveaway. <laughs> Picnic park closed at dusk. Here's a rowan. That, that's in form. Oh, well, that's absolutely perfect. No? I, I'd grab some of that if I were you. To do the bag with the apples. Oh, what's that? This is mountain ash or rowan. There you go. Perfect. Yeah. Mountain ash rowan. And it's in good harvesting condition and all. Pretty perfect. So we got some man and we can make some jelly. Yeah. There's a little birdie on them. Lovely long sandy beach. Just stop for some pie, something to eat. That's a big that pie we're about to eat. Is a pie. <laughs> <laughs> that is what you call a pie, boys and girls. That is huge. We've got to see what turns out now. Don't stand on that man's Okay, she's rolling her sleeves up. She means business. <laughs> this could be the best alfresco reveal ever. 
much half are you having, Pete? <laughs> Off the right side. Oh it's my gosh, that looks gorgeous. That looks beyond the pole, doesn't it? Okay, check out the stabbing action, boys and girls. Do not mess with this woman. <laughs> Yeah. Oh my gosh, they're huge. I am. Well, it's now cutting it in half again, it's a bit tricky. Look at those are pieces. No, that's not a bad job. Not bad at all. You should put your lobster down, Aspen. Tell me what you think, Aspen. Don't stand out, Maya. I thought that. This is work. Hey, it's that for you. Come get it. Put your lobster down. You don't need that, do you, when you're trying to eat that? Got him? Uh, it's alright, get lobbed back in a minute. Hey, my dog. Hey, dog. Yummy. What's it? So what's that like, Aspen? Nice. Is it good? What about Maya? Do you like it? Is it yummy? Looks yummy. All them leeks and taters and right, cheese. And mummy's great pastry. Kind of Perfect. It's <laughs> <laughs> lovely, isn't it? Well, the sun's come out and it's really gone warm and nice here. And the sea's so clear. <laughs> this wonderful, serene place is called Jerry Lawrence, Jerry Lawrence Provincial Park. Jerry Lawrence. She wants to call it Jerry Lewis, do you? Jerry Lawrence Provincial Park. So what we got here, look, we got all these goodies, got some veggies, no, some more pie, and we got a wasp already, he's got a yellow jacket, causing trouble. There seems to be no end of these lovely little picnic stops in secluded little areas of provincial parks like this along the uh, Nova Scotia coastline. Absolutely wonderful. It reminds me in a way of some of the places I've seen um, in videos of Sweden. Looks really nice. Love it here. <laughs> the children love it. Cumin cheese. We'll get it off, mate. I'm, I'm really impressed with this. This is a Dutch Gouda with um, cumin or Jira in it, and it's a fabulous uh, tasting cheese. Really nice. It's a fairly mature Gouda uh, with a nice deep flavour. Plus, it's also got this real fabulous nutty finish from the uh, cumin. Really gorgeous. The Stilton's great, as always. And um, the Borsan, it's done, down really good. <laughs> it's done pretty much a disappearing act. Because <laughs> that went really well on the white buns, didn't it? Yeah. And the pie's getting left alone for this sitting so yeah, far. We'll have that later. I think that'll be a nice little snack for later on. I've got the cheese in here. May, mate. Yeah. <laughs> And Aspen munching on a borsan. You love that borsan, don't you, Aspen? It's creamy, licious. That's why. You got a drink, here, Mimi? Well, the location's good, the food's good, the coffee's good, and the people are great. So we're doing well. We're doing good. We're doing well. He'd got a smile off Laura. Then look at that.
so the picnic was packed away with the same efficiency it was produced and we're all suitably refreshed yep. <laughs> time to move on Rowan, if we can. Rowan, yeah, that'd be nice. We get some more of that. Here, if you want to come and have a look. Oh yeah, some a mountain ash, yep. growing berries, and the wild apples. So wild we'll apples a, for the deer. We'll make a jelly. Impressive, it's a eh? Bonus. Yeah, it is a bonus. You need more of that Rowan, though, don't you? Yeah, I'm gonna go and grab it. So it's only. I think we might have to do the circle. No, it's just all the circle. <laughs> do the thunk it. I'm on the end of this uh, rather nice little fishing dock. There must be some good fishing off here. You could do a fishing trip to this. Gorgeous, it really is gorgeous here. Mom, you sound like a rod No, I didn't want to bring them up today. Mama, Dad, where's this? I don't know which one's your stick. I don't know which one's your stick. I always start, hello, mayors is that. So you come here. One, two, three. Two sticks. Because no. poo sticks, you have your own colour. So that's the Swiss Air Flight 111 Memorial. My brother will have a lot of interest in that. He's right into his air crashes. I want a hat. Oh look, one. cranberries growing. Get a little white one. Yeah, there's one. <laughs> Aren't they wonderful? Look, wild cranberries. These are all crowberries as well. Oh yeah. These crowberries. No, not those. Not them. These. This plant here. They look like um, that's oh, a yeah. crowberry plant, but there is there's a little berry there, but it's all sugar. Lovely. We like a bit of grunt muscle car. That's a beautiful lighthouse, isn't it? Really is impressive. I like this rock wall as well, that's a bit fun. A bit bouldering fun. I've got the sun in my face and I've got the wind pushing at me. You may not be able to hear me, but I think my smile should say it all. It's a bit of a swan song because I'm getting on a plane soon and leaving this beautiful place. 
but uh, I don't need to tell you I've had a wonderful time. Here we are on the windswept Peggy's Cove and uh, I've got to officially say thank you very very much to my wonderful and gracious host. Welcome. You've been the best, the best of people, the best of friends. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Beautiful scene, old Canadian scene of waterfront. This probably looks pretty much like it did 80, 100 years ago. I would have thought a bit of shoring up using concrete right there, but that is really a beautiful place. Look at this. Lots of little shops and stuff selling bric-a-brac lobster rolls lovely old houses beautiful only in nova scotia boys and girls only in nova scotia lobster lane If you have enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up. If you would like to follow my channel please subscribe and be sure to click the bell icon to receive notification of all my upcoming videos. Thanks for watching.